Thanks for watching Fox 31 News. I'm Romney Smith. The Albany Police Department held a press conference this afternoon to address an early morning shooting that left one officer injured. We were given some very good information. Uh, we have not made any arrests at this time, but we are following some leads. And I am very confident, based on what uh, uh, Detective Tyler has told me, that uh, we are headed in the right direction. And we believe, we believe that uh, the folks that uh, we are pursuing will be caught. Officer Willie Hall is now on administrative leave, and APD says he's doing just fine this evening. But earlier this morning, Fox 31's Melanie Kendall was on the scene, and she says that that injured Officer Hall. She has details from earlier this morning. A hostage situation turned SWAT standoff early Tuesday morning at 506 Haley Street. It all started with a call about a burglary just after 4 o'clock. When officers arrived on the scene, they heard a commotion inside the house. Um, at that point, additional officers began to arrive on the scene and several shots were fired. A bullet hit 27-year-old officer Willie Hall's vest, then ricocheted off and grazed his arm. He is fine. He has since been discharged from the hospital. With officers surrounding the house, the two victims got out quickly, shaken but unharmed. Believe me, that house was totally covered by officers from SWAT as well as uniform. We had officers from the Sheriff's Department or Sheriff's Office, Doherty County Police, as well as ATF on the scene. Once SWAT was inside the home, no suspects were found. Once SWAT made entry, they did discover some evidence, and uh, that will become a part of their investigation at this point. Stay connected to the latest details on our website, mysouthwestga.com. Melanie Kendall, Fox 31 News.